welcome. I'm Evan Amaya, and I'm currently flying toward Greenwood, where I'm based out of. Uh, we are 14 miles north of the field right now at 3,000 feet. Greenwood traffic, our helicopter 7224, uh, approximately 9 miles to the south. But like I was saying, we are now 13 miles north of the field, and I um, have had a couple of people request... Um, an example of how Smart Glide works. So Smart Glide is an option that is available with some Garmin equipment. And as you can see on my G3X, you've got this green circle around the airplane, which right now we're at 3,000 feet. It is a little bit turbulent, so um, we're at this present time. So bear with my phone a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait. I'm going to stay at 3,000. I'm going to wait until we are closer to the field, pull the power, and I'm going to enable, initiate Smart Glide. And the way it should work, the autopilot will take over. Um, it'll fly us to the nearest airport, which in this case is going to be pretty easy because it's going to be the airport in front of us. And then we will um, fly, um, let the Smart Glide bring us down to um, the airport. Now, it will not land the airplane. All it's going to do is bring us as close as it can to the airport um, in the most efficient way possible and also... Um, hopefully line us up somewhat for a an emergency landing on some surface. Um, at 1,000 feet, last time I did this, at 1,000 feet, it says uh, maneuver and land. So at that point, you know, they're done, and you've got to fly the airplane yourself. All right, I'm going to start pulling the power back as if we just lost the engine. So the power is all the way off, and I'm going to hit the direct two button. Smart Glide active. Airport. 12 o'clock. Three miles. All right, so what it's just done is it is changing my best glide to, um, it's changing the autopilot to best glide, which it's done here. The airport is straight ahead, as you can see out the window here. And it is just going to bring us to the airport. And the horn going off is for the gear. I could put the gear down, but if I put the gear down, it's going to slow down. Um, it's going to just increase my descent rate. So I don't really want to do that yet. Approaching airport. 12 o'clock. Two miles. So it's got the airplane at best glide by itself. And um, I'm just a passenger at the present time. Maneuver and land. 2000. Disconnect. Autopilot. So the autopilot now is saying disconnect autopilot. So you can see it's saying disconnect autopilot. We're over the airport and it's saying maneuver and land. Now, um, air, um, uh, carbon heat on, uh, fuel pump on, uh, master on, make sure rich. So the airplane is now maneuvering us around around the 2-7 out there. 1,000. Maneuver and land. Disconnect. Autopilot. So it's asking us to disconnect the autopilot. And land. Disconnect. Autopilot. Maneuver and land. So she's getting a little more upset with me for not... Maneuver and land. Disconnect. Autopilot. All right. So we're at 1,400 feet. Um, let's see if we can make this, this, this work out. Disconnect. Autopilot. Maneuver. Disconnecting autopilot. We're at 1,400 feet right now. So that is not a whole lot of altitude. So the question is, can I make it to runway 9 over here? 500. Greenwood traffic, 2733 X-ray is uh, left downwind, Niner, uh, simulated engine out. So to make this work, I'm going to have to cut the corner here pretty pretty tight. And even then, I might not be able to make it. All right, gear's coming down. Gear's locked. 100. 
70 50 What's in? 20 10 5 2 1 1 That'll get your heart rate going. So, um, I was able to make a power off 180 around um, to about midfield and land. Uh, I wish I had a camera on the outside videoing that because that would have been pretty cool to see. Um, so, Smart Glide. Um, it definitely can help you get to the airport. Um, I'll probably do another video with the Smart Glide uh, maybe going away from an airport. Um, instead of going toward the airport, obviously in this case we would know the airport's ahead of us. Uh, and I probably would have um, maneuvered a little differently to get to the runway. Um, but um, it is nice to know that you can use the system. And very much, very much traffic. You got a Bonanza, 3,200 feet, flying the lake west to east, Greenwood area. <laughs> All right, thanks a lot, guys.